I am not alone uh, in that it took me a little while to find and settle on the guitar that I like using most. And after playing 335s and strats and a number of different things, I settled on a Telecaster. Um, but for a while there, in order to get uh, single coil sounds and humbucker sounds, I would tra trade off to me a 335 and a Tele. But I found that I, uh, without a guitar tech and being the main front person, it was really slow in the showdown uh, when we were doing live performances to, to trade guitars. Uh, and so it just kind of hit me that I could uh, customize my Telecaster. There, a lot of people have, have done some famous modifications to, to Telecasters. And I decided I wanted to kind of make a Swiss Army guitar, Swiss Army knife guitar, if you will. Uh, so I worked with Joseph Duro here at Bailey Brothers to uh, customize the American Professional Telecaster that I had, which is this Sunburst guy right here. Uh, I really liked the way it played. Um, but I knew that, again, with uh, wanting the most versatility I could, I could get, um, changing some pickups and changing some wiring would be really helpful. So uh, kind of from top to bottom, we started by replacing the uh, neck lipstick single coil with a Seymour Duncan Pearly Gates, which has four wires, and that means you can fit it with a, uh, with a push-pull in order to, uh, to convert it into a single coil when you want to. Uh, then here in the middle, we've got a reverse round, reverse polarity, sing, uh, single coil strap pickup, and then a, uh, a vintage stack Tele bridge, uh, which, you know, the, uh, the stock pickup was pretty good. I find this got a little bit higher output that kind of makes it a little more even across the board. And uh, because it's the vintage stack uh, humbucker, you don't have any hum. Uh, and again, plenty of that Tele bite that you're looking for. Uh, I'm George Hip. I play guitar in the Credible Sources band with my brother Bob. Um, I want to tell you about my rig here. Uh, my guitar is the most important part of it. Uh, it's a PRS S2 McCarty 594. Um, I love this guitar. Uh, I grew up playing Les Pauls and uh, it's got real similar electronics to a Les Paul. Uh, I got the three-way selector switch, independent volume and tone controls. Um, these pickups, stock pickups, are dynamic. They respond well to playing. All the different little numbers on the controls give you a little bit different sound. Uh, it's also got independent uh, coil splitting uh, for the neck and the bridge pickups. And um, it's better than any coil splitting I've used before. Um, you get a little bit of drop in output, but it's minimal compared to some of the other guitars I've tried with coil splitting. Uh, you get great, to me, single coil sounds uh, out of it. Um, it works well with um, my uh, pedals and my amp. Um, the next easy to play. Uh, Brian Hinton down in uh, Bailey Brothers in Montgomery uh, set it up for me and he's got the action set where I can play slide or uh, standard uh, guitar uh, without having to change guitars and that's been that's been a huge huge um, advantage playing live. Um, so I'm in love with this guitar. Um, I recommend you check it out if you're in the market. All right, I'd like to say thanks a lot, everybody, for uh, hanging out with us and checking out some of our gear, getting to know us a little bit better. Uh, the album So Long comes out on June 3rd. The very next day, June 4th, we've got that album release show at Work Play Theater in Birmingham. And uh, make sure to check out Bailey Brothers Music when you have any music needs, whether it's lessons, gear, uh, or just some knowledge.